people complain that as a character Ichigo has no direction, but when a story arc comes along that serves to give him a clear sense of direction, they don't like it. There are so many loose ends and things that need to be explained. Over 10 plus characters have yet to show their powers. When Kubo actually gives the critics what they want, they fail to appreciate it. And what ends up happening is that they double down on their takes and refer to an excellent character driven story arc like the Fullbring arc as a filler arc. I want to see Shinji's Bankai. Royal Guard members that we need to see their Bankai, especially the guy, the uh, I forgot his fucking name. If you skip over the Fullbring arc, you'll be missing out on all of the pivotal growth that his character undergoes during the story arc. No Bankai from Aizen, we haven't seen Love's Bankai. Most of the visors haven't really released any Bankai. It grounded the entire story of Bleach in order for us to be ready for the upcoming story arc. During the Fullbring arc, we catch up with characters like Orihime, Chad, and Uryu, as well as learning more about Ichigo's day-to-day -day life. And Pachi has a Bankai that ends up being Yachiru, which doesn't make any sense. The Fullbring arc is an important prelude to the final arc of the series, as it bridges the gap from one portion of the story to the next. Kubo, what, what the fuck are you doing? He wasted so much time and had too many characters that showed up they were going to do something important, but they were never seen again. It's a refreshing return to roots, as we take a break from the Soul Society and the Gotei 13. Most of these characters are not going to get developed, we're not going to see everything. People just didn't like the Forbring arc because things had really calmed down. We were no longer up against Aizen, this big threat who had wanted to become a god. From these incredibly high stakes, we return to the humble beginnings of the story in Karakura Town. And in addition to this, our protagonist is nothing more than a normal teenager. I want to see some damn Bankais, goddammit. I have been a fan of this show and manga for so many years, it just will fucking piss me off if I don't see about 95% of everybody's powers. 